Welcome to the instructional videos for the Consolidation Orthographic Drawing Stream. In this video we will continue working through the principles and process of architectural orthographic drawing, specifically focusing on entourage and the inclusion of contextual cues in our drawings. Entourage is simply the inclusion of additional contextual information into our architectural drawings. Entourage includes elements such as vegetation and trees, furniture and props, and most importantly, people. Entourage both adds life and interest to our architectural drawings as well as providing important cues that help interpret the building being depicted. The human figure is the ideal measure of things in that our understanding of scale is innately linked to the understanding of our own size in the world. Groups of people and activities can also help convey a subtle understanding about how spaces are intended to work. In this sample one-point perspective drawing by Frank Ching, we are presented with a view of a simple and elegant building. We get a sense of the scale based on the background vegetation, but there are not many more cues beyond that. If we add some figures around an activity, immediately we get a different understanding of the building. In this instance, we get the sense that the building is some form of religious or ritual space based on the activity and the clothing of the figures in the scene. The scale of the figures in the space also gives us a better fix on the perception of scale that supplements the cues provided by the background vegetation. In another example, we can see a proposal for the Gallery of Modern Art in Queensland. In this hybrid drawing, we tried to show how the spaces would be used in the proposal for the Undercroft activity space. The intention was to show the space as a hive of activity and production, with figures in conversation and containers being moved on hoists overhead. Movement lines and groups gathered around activity helps to underline the intention, even though the level of detail of the figures is quite rudimentary. The underlying premise of the concept is further reinforced by a simple hybrid collage drawing showing one of the art containers in a rural location with a simple drawing over the top of a photograph. Creating your entourage is quite simple and over time you should build your own copyright free entourage library. There are many entourage figures available online and in library books, however it is often better to create your own in order to achieve results better suited to your particular context as well as taking elements from specific project sites. We covered some of the basic techniques of photography as part of the Photography Technical Skills series. Here we have posed a figure in a variety of positions that may be useful for some of our orthographic elevations and sections. It is good practice to edit out the figure from the background if you can. This way you can use the edited figure in photo montages that you make using Photoshop. It also makes tracing the figure for your line drawings a little bit easier. The level of detail is not critical and for single line architectural orthographic drawings it is perhaps better to use figures that have been stylized and simplified. Although the figure is not strictly orthographic it is planar enough that we can use it inside one of our previously completed pavilion elevations. It is a simple case of taking our figure from a separate printout, overlaying it on the scene and then editing the detail of the elevation so that the figure is properly contextualized. The editing of the figure to appear behind the batten screen also helps to add some depth to the drawing. Pay attention that the scale of the figure and that the scale of the drawing are well matched. The same process can be applied to other forms of entourage as well. Here we are using a botanical drawing of a bunya pine tree to generate an outline drawing that can be used in many types of orthographic drawings. In this instance, the image was sourced from a third party with copyright restrictions, but was used as a basis for a new drawing which in effect creates a new artifact that is now copyright free. The other aspect of using trees and vegetation is to use species that are local to the proposed project site. This adds another layer of comprehension and authenticity to your drawings. In addition, if there are significant trees on or around your project site, it is quite easy to photograph these and to trace them for your architectural drawings. Finally, like the human figure, it is important to scale the entourage elements appropriately to the scene so that they assist with the perception of scale and context. This ends the entourage instructional in the consolidation series of the architectural orthographic drawing workshops. As you can see from the demonstration, you do not need exceptional drawing skill to produce convincing and effective entourage. However, it is useful to build and maintain your own library of entourage that you can draw upon 
on short notice. Make sure to follow up with the other related instructionals in the consolidation series. And thanks again for your time.